Hey, it's me. It's been quite a few days. School has started and let me tell you, I think I stressed out for nothing and that is not to jinx the rest of the year. But that I had just about the smoothest first day of school ever and the first week of school ever even though it was only three days. I have never had a smooth start to school ever in the last eight, nine years. It has always been a crazy mess. Again, I don't want to jinx myself, but I'm loving school right now and I was not motivated to go back to school. I had no ideas going back to school. I had some lesson plans ready and I just feel like I'm ready right now. So. That's been a thing. Uh, not to say it wasn't exhausting because I'm, I'm definitely exhausted. But yeah, that's why I haven't really recorded anything. Just trying to rest up. My mom is also in town. So my first day of school was Wednesday. She got in Wednesday. I left school Thursday. Went and hung out with her for the entire night. Over at the Bay Lake Tower, we went to the Villains Lair. I'll put a couple videos in here of that. Friday night, I met her at the boardwalk where she's staying, and we just kind of hung out a little bit there. And then remembered that I had 12 hours of dance the next day. <laughs> so I had actually 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. yesterday. So I did leave hanging out with my mom early and went home to get some sleep. And yesterday was absolutely exhausting. Uh, I was definitely um, frustrated yesterday. Had a couple temper tantrums in the dance classrooms. I was just frustrated. I was also on my period, not that that's an excuse. Um, but I was cranky, uh, and because these kids haven't been dancing for two weeks, they act like they have no idea what their right and left foot are. So I was a little frustrating. So yeah, definitely had some cranky times yesterday. Got a lot done though. So most of my dance numbers are finished for the season. Most of them, and some of them have 30 seconds left before they're finished. So I should be finished almost I'm going to say 95% of my dance numbers, which I think I have 18 this year, um, before I go out for surgery in two and a half, three weeks. I'm feeling pretty good about where I am in life right now, which is not normal. I'm normally frustrated with everything and anxious about everything and paranoid about everything, but not, not this time. Knock on wood. Currently in the car, um, I woke up this, I, I think I broke a fever in the middle of the night. I even checked the air conditioner to make sure that it was me. Uh, I thought the air conditioner broke, that's how hot I got last night. Um, definitely had a fever, woke up with a screaming headache. Wasn't even sure I was gonna be able to meet my mom tonight. Threw up a little bit, I got nauseous. But after that I was fine, so I don't know what that was. Kinda just chilled this morning, chilled with the dogs. So now I'm meeting her and my sister at Hollywood Studios. I think that's right. Yeah, Hollywood Studios. We've got dinner planned. So this is going to be my ending meal. I'm not happy about it. Prime time is not my favorite restaurant. <sighs> but it is what it is. It's what they've picked. It's where I'm going. Tomorrow I start the Celebrate uh, Protein diet for two weeks, the pre-op diet, and yeah, that starts tomorrow. I will definitely weigh myself tomorrow morning. That is definitely happening. Yeah, that starts tomorrow. So I'll enjoy myself tonight. I'll definitely take a few videos tonight. I just want to spend some time with my mom before she goes back to enjoy myself at Disney. Uh, my sister does want to go to the Mickey's not so scary. I told her no. It's it's 10 days after surgery. I just don't know how I'll be feeling, but I also feel like I'm not gonna be able to ride the rides um, within 10 days of surgery. Definitely can't eat. So I think that's just an event I'm gonna save for next year. 
I used to go three, four, five times a year until it got way too expensive. Uh, I don't know if any of you have been, but it, when it first started, it was like 50 bucks to go to. So I would go like five or six times. Um, even when it became $70 to go to, I would go five or six times. And now it's like $150 to go to a damn party and half the stuff that they used to have there is non-existent. So I don't feel like it's worth the price. And for me, being 10 days out of surgery, not knowing how I'm gonna feel, not knowing if I'll be able to ride the rides, um, and definitely not being able to eat anything while I'm there, uh, I've just decided not to go this year. So maybe I will treat myself with that next August or September. So yeah, she's going to have to go alone on her birthday. I feel a little bad about that, but she'll be fine. Other than that, dance starts tomorrow. First full week of school. So a lot going on. I will try to do a video diary. Um, probably will be in the car from one job to the other job. But other than that, that's it.